Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. In today's video, we'll be working on a Ford Edge, guys, here. And if you need to remove or replace your brake light switch, okay, brake light switch, guys, also known, as, uh, also known as cruise control switch, stay with us and we'll explain how to do that. Not very complicated video, guys, and we'll show you what needs to be done. If you need to buy a new replacement switch, we'll have the link in the description of the video below for your convenience. Quick introduction, guys. Every single car we get at the shop, including this generation Ford Edge, we're making at least 200 videos. Why, guys? Why we take them completely apart? Because our mission here at the shop is to save you as much money as we can. So please, guys, subscribe to the channel and like the video in return. That's all we need. If you guys need to buy any replacement parts, tools, anything like that, we'll have the link in the description of the video below and you can see where we get them from. Really, it's pretty good price and uh, pretty quick shipping as well. This is, guys, a 2009 Ford Edge that will demonstrate how to remove and replace brake light switch. Not very complicated at all. Uh, we'll show you what needs to be done. If your brake light switch malfunctions, what could happen? You may not be even able to put the uh, forward edge in gear because you will not detect that the brake, uh, the brake pedal is uh, pressed. Another thing, guys. Okay, your brake lights may not work and your cruise control may not work as well. So you need to check that as well. Now, what needs to be done, guys, okay, to get to the brake light switch? Pretty simple. So if you come right here on top of the pedal, okay, let me show you now on top of the pedal guys right there that um, that blue thing okay that blue thing right there okay perfect like that you need to grab it guys okay and you need to turn it okay it goes only one certain way you can see how it moves but then it gets stuck you need to guys turn it okay from what I can see it needs to go okay counterclockwise but it is stuck a little bit so let me show you now guys you do not go okay you do not go counterclockwise you go actually clockwise so i'll grab it like that it may be stuck a little bit so you need to okay grab it and pull it out now right here we need to disconnect it by pressing right here and disconnect wire okay and you can see guys the brake light switch okay is out of the car okay just like that now, uh, you can see those are the teeth that get stuck, okay, right there, and uh, it goes in uh, on that plate on top, okay, right there, and this is the device that tells, okay, the brake lights and the cruise control if the brake paddle is depressed, so you can see this is uh, detecting if it's on and off, that's why you guys have four, four wires, not just the tube, but it actually controls the cruise control as well. So if you need to get a new one, check out the link in the description of the video below, we will have it there. And then you just grab it, okay, how you do it, pretty simple guys, connect your wire, okay, like that, connect the wire, now you need to find the swats, okay, right there and just turn it back okay and it's ready so hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time